Hey everyone, and welcome to another Space Engineers update video. In this week's update, we are releasing a revised building system. From now on, you can create a new grid from any block, not just from a landing gear. And you can do this simply by placing a block in any open area. You can see that there are new symbols at the top of the screen when a building block is selected on your toolbar. The upper indicates whether you are creating a new grid or building on an existing one by placing a block. The two lower icons indicate whether you are currently building with large or small ship blocks and you will need to switch between them by pressing R. We've also made changes to the G screen by tidying it up, organising it and putting similar blocks into groups. You can see if a block type has variants by the plus symbol in the top right corner of its thumbnail. To switch between variants, use the mouse scroll wheel. These changes should make building much more intuitive and time efficient. Just a side note, zooming in and out of third person view now requires you to hold Alt combined with the mouse scroll. It's also worth mentioning that any grid that is pasted into voxel from the clipboards will now become a static grid. This includes small ships and you can place them in the ground at any angle. Because of the changes we made to the building system, we had to adjust how blueprints are projected from projectors. Now it depends on the first place block of a blueprint. This means that the offset values in projectors will have to be corrected to account for this in all existing creations. Moving on now, and bugs fixed this week include weapon muzzle flash lagging behind character movement, collisions being ignored when pacing a grid, and oxygen generators not consuming ice on dedicated servers. Some small fixes were also made for rotors and pistons, as well as some more crashes being resolved. Lastly, the major improvements for the Mod API and in-game programming mentioned last week are going live today. So if you are a modder or a scripter and missed the announcement, be sure to check the link in the description box below. But that's all for now. To see the full list of features, bug fixes and improvements, please go to the update change log on our forums. Thanks for watching. Please leave your feedback and comments below. And here's a quote to end on. Astronomy compels the soul to look upward and leads us from this world to another.